even as some of you needed a special episode of this ff so here's it it has been one month a young become have a cat and he was trying to adjust with his new life but everything was so hard for him especially his feelings to always be with his love jungkook jungkook thing was irritated his ear twinged with discomfort and he still sweat with alertness the male held on to the red plastic cup and leaned against the wall as he watched his friends playing games together thing was supposed to be alone with right now not entertaining the entire friend group that's my hotel pay up jimin ex- exclaimed and yongi grumbly picked out his monopoly cash and giving the money to his boyfriend it wasn't that they had disliked being with his friends they made him comfortable enough to not have to hide his cat features he was just irked because jungkook had turned on a movie thing and himself and their friends showed up randomly to hang out the hybrid bite onto the edge of the cup with his soft teeth only to pull them out of the plastic and look down at what he did with embarrassment oh, thank threw the cup away in the kitchen and went to his room setting the door behind him was in that jungkook looked up with a bit of confusion i will be right back guys jungkook got up walking down the hallway to thang's room and knocking on the door go away thang muttered oh jungkook figured thang was having a bad bit of bad day are you okay thangi jungkook asked there was a pause come come in jungkook open the door to see the kitten lying down on the bed his room was in organized chaos with clothes on the floor and books opened on the desk as well as cups on the beside table jungkook sat on the edge of the bed sit beside him wasn't what's going on jungkook reached over to scratch the herbert's ear drawing soft force from the kitten it's supposed to be me and you today cookie the hung whispered huh jungkook did i couldn't hear the kitten i'm tired and everyone is so loud the hung replied loudly i'm sorry baby i can tell them to go home jungkook spoke the hung didn't say anything basi basking in the comfort of jungkook's hand in his hair jungkook looked at them with an unreadable look in his eyes the hybrid's cute form made him want to pull the male into the embrace and hug him tightly i will be right back jungkook pulled his hand away and them audibly winded only to blush and pull his blanket over his head from him the embarrassment i don't care you don't have to come back thang let his mouth betray his mind jungkook frowned he knew thang well enough to understand that they didn't mean it but it hurt sometimes to hear such word from thang why he always act cold oh jungkook left the room thang crawled into himself why did i even say that thang thought Jungkook looked out at his friends Yoongi and Jimin. I'm sorry to cut this short guys. It's just Thang is not feeling too well and the noise is getting to his ears. Jungkook lied. Ah, oh, Jimin frowned. Jimin frowned. I hope he feels better soon. The friends begin to clean up and after themselves putting the games away. Jungkook waved them off before returning to Thang's room. They left Thethe. Jungkook mumbled before leaving the setting the door behind him. Thang shifted from under the blanket and sat up to see Jungkook really didn't hadn't came back. 
As you have said that Jungkook is my heart, the Herbert watched the door for a moment longer before frying and getting out of the bed to look for Jungkook. The CEO boss was sitting on the couch alone watching a movie. Thang fidgeted with his fingers. Um, Cookie, what are you watching? Jungkook didn't even glance up at him. Iron Man? Uh, Thang see a flutter on his head. Are you enjoying it? Thang stuttered. Um, Jungkook replied, Why would you come out here, Thay? Jungkook asked, just Thang really want to say, sigh to admit that he wanted the CEO boyfriend to come back to to get a snack. Thang, the hybrid lied and turned to go to the kitchen. Jungkook finally looked up to see Thang walking away. Why can't Thay just say, just be honest so you didn't come here to hang out with me jungkook spoke hoping to correct the kitten into speaking his mind thank froze um, no jungkook was annoyed i'm going to go to namjoon hyung's place he stood up thank turned back around quickly what why because thank you clearly did don't want me here, Jungkook spoke. No, that's not true. I do want I think blush tail swaying anxiously. Please don't go, Cookie. I want to be around someone who is honest. You are you have been pushing me away for so long now, Thi, and you have gotten more cold than before. The CEO said the truth. That's because for so long I have been in love with you and but now I just want to be around you all the time. Thang wanted to say but he couldn't. Thang didn't Jungkook to get bored or frustrated of him but it seems he is ruining it on his own. Jungkook watches as the Hyber struggle to reply. The CEO grabbed his things. I will be back tomorrow. The male left the apartment. Thang started after him to a uh, building up sadly and the high bird sunk to the kitchen floor crying to himself. Thang really wanted to tell Jungkook everything but he is afraid to make Jungkook freak out and his desire to be around with the CEO boyfriend all the time. Thang he kept crying a bit harder. He really did love Jungkook. Jungkook returned the house the next morning to hear completely silent. Usually Thang was awake by now eating something. The CEO went to check the Hybert's room to see what is what that is what impati Jungkook was a bit anxious Thang he called out for the kitten boyfriend and received no response he checked his room and the bathroom to see no trace of the kitten But Thang's shoes are still at the door. Jungkook entered the kitchen and saw the Hubbard on the floor asleep. I swelled from crying. Jungkook frowned, crouching on the floor and running his fingers through the small boyfriend's hair and cat ear, then trailing his hand down to cup Thang's cheek. You shouldn't sleep here. It's not comfortable, Thethe. Thang stood gently before nuzzling against Jungkook's hand. Thang could smell his CEO boyfriend's comforting accent and opened his eyes half awake. Why did you leave me, Cookie? Thay muttered, closing them again, eyes twitching quickly. Jungkook flinched why he left his precious small boyfriend here all alone. He lifted up the high bird carrying him back to the his bedroom and placing him on the bed and 
सो सो सॉरी माई लाभ चाँक एंड थैंग पेटेड हेज कैट या फ्यू आवर्स लेटर थैंग वो का पेन बेड कम्प्लीटली कन्फ्यूज ही कुडेंट स्वेल ही वॉज इन ही कुड स्वेल ही वॉज इन किचन अ मोमेंट ए गो ही चेकड हेज बिसाइड टेबल एंड सा दैट इट वॉज ट्वेल्व मोन नोन आई मस्ट हैव स्लीप वॉकड ही concluded getting out of the bed to clean up for this morning the habit was surprised to smell the pleasant accent of his boyfriend jungkook's his back the habit was feeling a bit nervous what if jungkook doesn't speak to him ever again he seems very upset the last night before then didn't know what he would do if the person he loved the most hated him The habits he had flattered again, with sadness is still no longer alert as he dragged to downwards. He decided to wash up, then go back to his room and be sad all day. He was too anxious to face Jungkook. Jungkook placed two plates down at the table and waited for Taehyung to come out and join him, but the small boyfriend didn't. Jungkook said he shouldn't have left. like that yesterday he knew how sensitive thehung could be at thehung was too sensitive from the start but after turning as a habit cat he is more sensitive now but jungkook didn't think that his kitten would avoid eating for the day too the seal run a hand through his messy hair before going to get thehung himself he opened the door forgetting to knock and found the habit curl up on his bed crying jungle felt his heart clench them then froze quickly wiping his tears away and covering his face you you are here why jungle wanted to ask him many questions Why was Thayong crying? Why wouldn't he came it? Why wouldn't Thayong be honest? But seeing the boy like this, he couldn't. Jungkook sat down on the bed beside Thayong. I'm sorry, love. You don't have anything to be sorry, Kuki. Thayong whispered, sitting up in bed and wiping his eyes again. It's my fault, anyways. I have been such a bad boyfriend recently. I don't know what I'm doing. Thang, Jungkook wrapped his arm around the habit, pulling him close and kissing him on his lips. I don't know what's going on with you, but I shouldn't have praised you for the answer like that yesterday. Thang couldn't continue to cry, hugging Jungkook back. I'm really sorry. Kuki, I don't mean to hurt your feelings with what I have said. I, I didn't mean any of it. I only said it because Thang bit his lips. Jungkook pulled away, and they faced each other, the, each another, and Thang couldn't keep it in anymore. Kuki, I. Always cry for you, touch and want to be close to you. All the time, Thayong cried. I know that you will hate it and get bored of me for being too clingy. I don't want to lose you, Kuki. And for that, I have been trying to act cold, but I have just been hurting you. Jungkook looked at Thayong and saw this was the secret that his little boyfriend had been. Give him from him. How could Jungkook be so blind? Thank you. And I know you might feel a bit disgusted at the thought of even being with a hybrid, but I couldn't control this feeling. I'm so sorry. The small kitten applied over and over. Wait, no, don't apply. Jungkook covered Thank's cheeks gently. You know I love you, Thay. I love you so much and love everything about you. And I would love to have a cleansing kitten around me all the time. I wouldn't be disgusted on you. How can you even think about this, Thay? 
You are so precious for anything like this, Jungkook said, kissing his baby kitten's lips. Don't worry guys, this is not yin it. I will release the next episode tomorrow because uh, I couldn't get time to work on it. So, um, I will finish it tomorrow and upload it. And I hope you will love it. So, don't forget to share your feelings with me in the comment section. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.